happy vlogmas day four. It's 2.30. Fuck. Look who's back. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> Granted, I've been really good the past three days and I have been vlogging in the morning, so it was just more so of a like, hey, good morning. If you watched yesterday's vlog, I told you guys that he was coming back today. He surprised me and came home last night and that was really exciting and we just made pasta and stayed up till like one or two in the morning. I had to show him all of my other vlog misses because he's been missing out. And then we went to bed and we slept in and I've been waking up really early and going to bed really late, so I felt really good to like sleep in until like 11 and then we just had a really slow start to the day. So it's 2.30, we're just now getting up and going to get food. <laughs> Before we leave, quick, oh, oh, too deep. What did I just say? Before we leave, I'll show you my outfit. I have this sweater on. It has like the cold shoulder on both sides. I think it's really cute. I'm wearing Griffin's necklace that he got me for our anniversary. My regular Fabletics leggings. And then for now, I just have these brown boots on, but I really don't like them. I don't think it looks well with this outfit, but I don't have black booties and I need to get some. So for now, we got brown. Griffin's wearing a flannel, some green pants. You look like a Christmas tree. He's so festive. Got the red, the green, the red. Wow. We're going to Piata for lunch today. And then we have some fun things on the agenda. I really wanna start doing some decorating and like, well I guess not decorating today probably because we're getting a really late start on the day, but definitely shopping because I thought I saved my tree if you guys watched the Vlogmas last year, but we can't find it in the apartment and I don't know where the tree is. So I guess either we must have left it or I must have left it in my old apartment or we threw it away, I don't know. But we don't have a tree and now we need to do some Christmas shopping, buy a tree, buy some, all the all the things. I'm starting out with the best thing at this place which are these garlic dough. If you've never had them, they're freaking delicious. I got two of them. And then I also got a BLT Piata. I've never tried before, so that'll be interesting. What did you get? Avocado Piata. Avocado. Our first stop on um, Christmas decor shopping is at Michael's because I am one of their like member things and they send out coupons all the time in the emails and things are always on are sale. Actually? Yes. <laughs> So we're gonna check out, I see what the stop here prices. My mom said to go. <laughs> well, that's because we're both members and we get the emails. <laughs> <laughs> so we're getting, we're gonna see what the stuff looks like here. But we'll probably end up going to like Hobby Lobby or other places too. But we'll start here. I can't wait till we have a cute little house to put a wreath on the front door. I think we want this tree. It's so cute. Oh my goodness, it's a seven footer, which I think is is that's good. That's good. Oh, we need to get a star for the tree too. We need to get everything. We don't have anything. <laughs> we also need stockings. I feel like we could get more personalized stockings. I say like a Hobby Lobby or even like a Target, literally something else, but we should definitely probably get the tree here because I know I have like a coupon in my email to get this cheaper. We're gonna do a lot of our like decor shopping at Hobby Lobby because I liked what they had when we went Thanksgiving or shopping, or like fall shopping, but the tree will definitely get here. So I feel like that's a good deal. What is that? Evidence. <laughs> <laughs> this will be my new margarita class for the holidays. <laughs> We have a tree. Next stop, Hobby Lobby. Booby Looby. Booby Looby. Booby Looby. <laughs> I'm loving this like eclectic Christmas. Griffin would never let me do this. I bought one of these trucks for fall and it has like pumpkins in the back. This one has a tree. Oh yeah, apples, you're right. I feel like we need it. We have to like trade it out. These stockings look and feel like puffer jackets and Griffin likes them. That's so weird. Maybe third time is the charm. Mm. Eh. How festive. I used to have like a giant one of these and I used to like put it on my face and like, and then you'd let it sit up. Peace. Oh my God. <laughs> Speaking of those little stupid toys, I want to do like the, the TikTok-y like target thing where we like buy gifts for each other. I want to do that. I think it'd be so fun. We'd come up with some, some stupid. So Griffin had like a tradition. If you do that one then, do I have to do something that's like similar or just anything? I say we get this tiny tree, Griffin. Another tree? Listen, this tiny one and get really tiny ornaments for it. These ones and it's Kitty's tree. And then Kitty can have her own area by her shrine. And then we have like a baby stocking for her. It can have a baby tree skirt. I think it's a cute idea. Alrighty guys, we just got home and I wanna show you everything that we got. However, I'm just gonna point out that I'm actually very disappointed. We went to three different stores and literally none of them really had anything, I guess, that we liked. Hobby Lobby really didn't have much, which I was surprised because we loved their fall decor. Like little stuff like this that I have in this tray that you guys are sitting on. I wanted to find like new small stuff like this to like fill the areas and I thought that they would have a lot more. They really didn't. Michaels had stuff, but I didn't really like anything that they had. It was a lot more expensive. And then Target was like wiped, which maybe I just 
just need to go to a couple different targets or we try again another day, which we're definitely gonna have to because we didn't get anything for the tree other than a topper. But I guess let's start with Michael's because that's where we went first. Of course, we got the tree. You guys saw it in the video and it's pre-lit, really cute. I'm excited. We're gonna set that up another day, of course, because like I said, we don't have anything for it. And then while we were checking out in the checkout aisle, they had like a buy one, get one free like wrapping paper. So Griffin chose his and I chose mine. That way you can like wrap each other's gifts in each other's paper. And so I got this really cute like snowflake wrapping paper, which I thought was adorable. And then Griffin got this kind of, I guess like metallic-y green with Christmas trees on it. And one of it was $4.99. So we got two for $4.99. And then Griffin also wanted to get, this was in the checkout aisle. I've never heard of this before. This is a sensical, which is like a Christmas berry, smells fresh cut. It's like an ornament for your tree, but I guess like they smell really good. Oh. Oh, interesting. I guess you like hang these up on your tree and it helps smell it like it's like real or fresh cut even though it's not. So this will be fun. The house will smell yummy for a very long time. Our tree was only 80 bucks. The wrapping paper was 4 dollars and then this I think was like $6.99. And that's our Michaels haul. And then we went to Hobby Lobby. And the only like real thing that I got that I'm actually excited for is this truck because we have one. This is a lot bigger than the other one I got. But we have one on some shelves over here that I got for fall. It's filled with like apples, I think, or pumpkins. And this one has like a little Christmas tree in it and of course it's teal, matches our kitchen. So I'm excited to put this on the counter somewhere. And then Griffin saw this ornament and he obviously showed it to me and we couldn't not get it because it's freaking adorable. And it's just a little red door ornament. But down here it says like first Christmas in our new home in 2020 here. And I know we don't have like a home. This is an apartment, but honestly the home is where the heart is. And this is our first Christmas in our new home together. So that's really cute that he found that and we got that. And then literally the only other piece of even decoration that I could find that I liked at Hobby Lobby was this tree, which like, yes, it's cute but even then it's kind of anticlimactic to me like I felt like they were gonna have a lot more cute stuff but they didn't the home ornament was only $5.99 the truck was $19.99 and then the Christmas tree was $7.49 relatively cheap stuff again we did get more things at Target but it wasn't even stuff that we were looking for or really wanting or even just Christmas tree stuff even just decorations but I did really want some chocolate so we got some Hershey kisses and then Griffin picked out these stockings for us which are adorable they have a G and an M and they actually have like a little pocket in here I don't know really what for but that's really cute in my opinion and then we got a little tiny stocking kitty staring at me from the bedroom tiny stocking for kitty and it's so freaking cute i'm gonna freaking die we couldn't find one that was like striped like it but i still think it's cute especially if it were to be like a an every other thing like look at that that is so cute we did find our christmas tree topper which is this little wood star it has like lights on it which i thought was really cute i think it'll go well because a lot of our accents in here i guess is like kind of dark water we have like the dark wood flooring and it really was the only cute option that they had and even at Hobby Lobby or Michael's all of their tree toppers I didn't think were that cute I don't know if we just went at like the worst time where there's absolutely nothing and that's all picked over I'm also just now noticing that that's not even lights it's just glitter and that it was like little lights in there but it's just sparkles and then the last two things we got from Target are absolutely adorable it's for a future video but I'm really freaking excited and it's these gingerbread houses that Griffin I got and we're gonna build these at some point but they were like 20% off and so I think they ended up being only like seven dollars or something and there's one other thing that Griffin ended up getting and this is something that I guess he does with his family kind of like a tradition that they do every year and he wants to kind of incorporate that within like our own tradition and I absolutely love it I think it's adorable but I couldn't find one for him on this trip because again selection was slim everywhere for all of these things so I'm gonna have to find him something else later but what he wants to do is essentially every year we buy each other a, an ornament we can get an ornament together of like something that big that's happened in our lives or whatever like this one and then I get him one and he gets me one that's I don't know signifies something that happened during that year or something that's like truly them whatever it may be just a fun little memory keepsake in an ornament. We got this one together for our first apartment and then he got, and this one is so fitting, this ornament for me. And it is a tequila bottle that we can hang on the freaking tree. And I love it. I absolutely love it. He's like, this is you in an ornament. And I don't disagree. I just need to find one for him because there really was nothing for him. I really want her to kiss right now. We should have gotten like a cute jar. Maybe this opens. Cause this has like this in here. I feel like this opens and maybe I can throw all these kisses in here. It does. Okay, that's what we're doing. Like, look at how cute this is. Truck, Hershey Kisses. I'm obsessed. And this will sit on our coffee table and that'll be so cute. Oh my God. I was trying to find the ones. Griffin didn't know what I was talking about. There's Hershey Kisses that are like split or like there's white chocolate Hershey Kisses, but there's the ones that are like chocolate and white chocolate. And those ones are the best. They didn't have a bag of those. They had a bag of just milk chocolate, dark chocolate, and then like a brown and white mix, which I thought were the ones. And I'm so glad I didn't get them because they were like a peppermint. And I don't really like peppermint. Mm. 
But I'm kind of disappointed that we just didn't find more, but I guess that'll just give us another day to go shopping. Let me know if you guys are able to find stuff or did we just like hit it at a wrong time, do you think? Should we try again? Are there different places that we should go? Because we got a very late start on today's vlog, it's already eight o'clock at night and all we've done is like shop. But on that note, I am gonna go ahead and close the vlog so that way I can edit and I'm not up too late. But I love you guys and I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog and enjoyed that Griffin's finally back and he'll be in obviously a bunch more of these vlogmases now that he's here. I've already eaten like 12,000 of these little kisses. I literally brought a whole handful with me to my desk to eat while I edit. I love you guys so much, more than you'll ever know, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. Oh, kitty, hello.